new skating here as today we're gonna play some minecraft in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how to build a realistic elevator so without further ado let's get into the video by showing you the design then we're gonna build the thing and check if it works okay guys so this is my realistic elevator design I am quite proud of it and uh, I'm gonna be honest it looks a lot better than my last elevator yeah if you remember guys and if you're true OGs um, I made a video about uh, elevators uh, a while ago, and but I wanted to come back here because I'm gonna be honest, it didn't look good. No, it was glazed terracotta all the way. So you come in here. This is just like part of decoration. Of course, you don't need it. You have a arrow facing where you're gonna go. And a button for the activation of the lamp for, uh, for some aesthetics. Here we have uh, your, let's say, shuttle. You go up here, uh, it's like a standard flying machine at the back. I also added some glowstone so you have some light. And uh, the glowstone looks quite nice going through the glass here. Um, all of the redstone in terms of the activation is down there. I'm gonna show you how to do it when we get to the build. So I'm gonna press the button and we're going up. As you can see guys, it looks nice from outside. It stops really nicely. Okay, I'm gonna stop chatting and let's just get into the build. These are the items that you need for 10 blocks between the platforms. Glass, every block you go up, you multiply the glass amount by 3, the blocks times 3. Here, uh, I have invisible item frames. This is for the stairs, which show the direction. Okay, guys, I'm gonna start things off with going 3 up with your strip spruce logs, one, two, three. Then you make a three gap and fill in the gap with an iron blocks. And you go one, one, two, three, three. Here you place your iron blocks again, like so, very nice. Here you place your iron blocks and you place your temporary iron block, this one here, break this one. Here, you're gonna place a red turn lamp, like so. Up here, you place your invisible or visible item frame, place the stairs and rotate them facing upwards, and use a button, place it on the lamp. Okay, and now for the actual flying machine. Here, you have a one block gap. This is for the place that you're gonna be standing on. Here, you go two down, and here you go three down so you take your furnace your furnace here you're gonna take two furnaces here and two extra furnaces here that's all of the furnaces we need for now you can place your block of iron already here we need to place a normal piston with an observer facing the other way <laughs> like so yes so it activates here we place redstone you need to shift click on the furnace i'm gonna fill this back up <coughs> like so uh here we're gonna place an observer this time face this way with a sticky piston facing this way 
two slime blocks here another sticky piston facing this way so you need to use some iron blocks as temporary blocks place it here and go one more up with the temporary blocks and place your observer and your slime blocks here if i'm not mistaken this is all for your slime machine yeah it works okay and it flies down and stops great now you need to do a sequence here you need to go strip log one two three of glass strip log strip log one two three of glass strip log and this will be the part here so how much blocks of difference you uh, decided to have that's how much you need to repeat this log Glass, 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 glass. Okay guys, I have 10 blocks and now we're gonna go one more up of spruce blocks and this time we're gonna fill it in with iron. Again, you go three up with the spruce logs, one, two, three. You cover the gap with iron and one, two, three on the other side. So you need to have a two gap. Like on the bottom here, you place a temporary block to place this. You need a redstone lamp here. Here another temporary block to place these two blocks. I'm gonna go with the item frames again. Item frames, tear facing downward this time and a button. Okay, now you're gonna come up here. In the middle, go one to the back, rise one more. Here you place rest and dust. Observer facing the, the dot upwards with two rest and dust like this. And a piston facing downwards like so. And the furnace here. If I'm not mistaken, you're done with the activation on the top. Uh, so now I'm gonna fill in the decorations. Oh, and of course uh, We need to add the glowstone up the back here Now I'm pretty sure you're done. I almost always forgot. I always forgot I forget. So of course you need to pull her up here Yes, now it's done. Okay, let's test it yeah, look at that. Really nice. Whoa, yeah. That, that's like heaps better from my last video. I'm gonna, if I don't forget, I'm gonna put a clip of it in post. So guys, I really do hope that you enjoyed this video. It was a ton of fun to make and I actually will probably use this in one of my survival servers with my friends. I will showcase it on this YouTube channel. So stay tuned. I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.